I'd like to yield two minutes to my great friend, uh, my colleague from Minnesota, a, a true champion of life, um, the representative from Minnesota, two minutes I would yield. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Representative Fishbach, for allowing me uh, to speak and for your leadership on this issue. Mr. Speaker, I rise today to recognize the 50th anniversary of the Supreme Court's Roe v. Wade decision. Over the past five decades, we have seen the devastation of this ruling, which has led to the loss of tens of millions of innocent lives here in the United States. I am heartened by the Supreme Court's reversal of this decision in Dobbs v. Jackson last year and the countless lives that will now be saved each year. For me and my family, the sanctity of life is deeply personal. Nearly 20 years ago, my wife Jody and I became parents of a baby born with Down syndrome. And whenever I look at my son Isaac, I see a miracle, God's special gift to our family. Today, Isaac is an incredible, kind, and charming young man, and we know his future is bright. Now imagine what kind of world we would be living in if every child was given the same chance to reach their potential. The world would be much better and our collective future would be much brighter. Since the start of the current Congress, the House has voted on two bills to protect and support life. I am proud that all of my Republican colleagues join me in supporting these very important measures. Unfortunately, very few of my Democrat colleagues joined us in support. To those Democrats who joined us in defending life, I commend you for your courage to stand up to the radical wing of your party, which pushes for abortion on demand, without limits, and paid for with taxpayer dollars. The right to life should not be a partisan issue. I extend an olive branch to all of my Democratic colleagues from across the aisle and encourage them to join us in our fight for life and to protect the most innocent among us, the unborn. It is up to us to do what is right and always defend life. And I yield back. 